done. All right. So why were these blind men called Jesus, Lord, and son of David? Well, they knew that the Messiah would be a descendant of King David. Right. It showed that they recognized Jesus as the Messiah. Right. But this was a key name for the Messiah. Right. Mm -hmm. So these blind beggars could ah. see with their spiritual eyes right. and right. felt with their hearts that Jesus was the long-awaited Messiah. Right. There were so many people who witnessed Jesus' miracles who could see but were blind right. to his identity. I know there's nobody in here like that. You can see, but you're blind to his identity. There's nobody here like that. These are the ones who refuse to open their eyes to the truth. Open their eyes to the truth. So these blind men could see Jesus with their heart. Church, how many of you know that seeing with your eyes does not guarantee seeing with your heart? We want to 
see Jesus. Amen. Oh, what compassion Jesus had for these men. He took the time to demonstrate what it means to care for someone, to serve others. Say that's what it's all about. It's about servanthood. Yes. We must serve yes. one another, yes. encourage one another, yes. lift up one another, yes. be there for one another. Yes. That's what we're about yes. as Christians. We want to see Jesus. He took the time to demonstrate what it means to care for someone, to serve others. Blindness was considered a curse from God. Did you know that? It was considered a curse from God for sin. If you, if you, if you were blind, you know, it was because you said you did something. I don't know what it is, but you did something. That's what they would say. But Jesus didn't let that idea stop him. He touched their eyes. Yeah. Immediately they received their sight and they followed him. Yeah. Immediately, not later. They received their sight and immediately they followed Jesus. Yeah. They could easily have said, well, we want to go to Jerusalem with you. Man. That's what we want. Uh, or, or we want a cup of water. Can you just spare a cup of water, Jesus? Uh, but they simply asked for their greatest need. Church, it is time for us to let Jesus heal our blind lives. Yes. Let Jesus touch you tonight. Let him open your eyes to the truth. Yes. God loves us, and he only wants the best for us. That's all right. He gave his best. That's right. And he only wants the best for us. What do you want Jesus to do for you tonight? Is the question. Open your eyes, church. Open your eyes and see Jesus tonight. Know him for yourself. Call on God for mercy. Open your eyes, Lord. We want to see Jesus. And when you call on Jesus, the Holy Spirit within you begins to move inside your heart. And he moves inside your head. And he moves inside your spirit. And you become spiritually in tune to whatever the Lord has to do. So I say to you, Open the eyes. Open our eyes, Lord. We want to see Jesus. Open my eyes, Lord. We want to see Jesus. To reach out and touch Him. And say that we love Him. Open our ears, Lord. Help us to listen. Open our 